Hello, welcome to Digit Math. Today we're going to learn about adding two digit numbers. Are you ready? We'll go through 10 questions together, so let's test your skills. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and leave your like. Let's go! 48 plus 29 is time to think. 48 plus 29 is time to think. Let's calculate. In the units column, we have 8 plus 9. Adding 8 and 9 gives 17, so we put 7 in the units place and carry over 1 to the tens column. In the tens column, we have 4 plus 2 plus the one we carried over, making it 4 plus 2 plus 1 equals 7. So the final result is 48 plus 29 equals 77. 66 plus 19 is? Time to think. 5. Let's go to the answer. In the units column, we have 6 plus 9. Since the sum of 6 and 9 is 15, we write down 5 and carry over 1 to the tens column. In the tens column, we have 6 plus 1 from the carryover plus 1 from the next number, resulting in 6 plus 1 plus 1 equals 8. So the final result is 66 plus 19 equals to 85. 67 plus 18 is time to think. 5. Let's go to the answer. In the units column, we have 7 plus 8. Since 7 plus 8 equals 15, we write down 5 and carry over 1 to the next column. Now looking at the tens column, we have 6 plus 1 plus 1 from the carryover, making it 8. So the final result is 67 plus 18 equals 85. 56 plus 18 is time to think. 5. Let's go to the answer. In the units column, we have 6 plus 8. 6 plus 8 equals 14, so we put 4 in the units place and carry over 1 to the tens column. In the tens column, we have 5 plus 1 plus 1 from carrying over. 5 plus 1 plus 1 equals 7. So the final result is 56 plus 18 equals 74. 77 plus 68 is time to think. 5. Let's go to the answer. First, add the units. 7 from 77 plus 8 from 68 equals 15. Write down 5 and carry over 1. Now add the tens along from 77 plus 6 from 68 plus 1 carried over equals 14. Write down 14 in front of the 5. So, the final result is 77 plus 68 equals 145. 76 plus 48 is time to think. 5. In the units column, we add 6 and 8, which equals 14. Place 4 in the units column and carry over 1 to the tens column. In the tens column, add 7, 4, and the carried over 1, which makes 12. So the final result is 76 plus 48 equals to 124. 46 plus 18 is time to think. 
let's break it down to solve it. We start by adding the unit's digits. 6 plus 8 equals 14. We write down the 4 and carry over the 1. Now, in the tens column, add 4 plus 1 plus the carried over 1, which equals 6. So the final result is 46 plus 18 equals 64. Thirty-five plus sixteen is time to think. Let's go to the answer. First, add the units five and six. This equals eleven. Place the one in the units column and carry the one to the tens column. In the tens column, now add 3 from 35, 1 from 16, and the carried over 1, making a total of 5. So the final result is 35 plus 16 equals 51. 74 plus 29 is time to think. Let's move to the answer. First, start by adding the units. 4 from 74 plus 9 from 29. This equals 13. Write down the 3 and carry the 1 to the tens column. In the tens column, add the following. 7 from 74 plus 2 from 29 plus the carry over 1. This equals 10. So 10 goes in the tens column and the 3 remains in the units column. Thus, the final result is 74 plus 29 equals to 103. 39 plus 29 is time to think. Let's go to the answer. In the units column, add 9 to 9, which equals 18. Place 8 in the units column and carry over 1 to the tens column. In the tens column, Add 3 to 2, which equals 5. Add the carried over 1 to 5, making 6. So the final total is 39 plus 29 equals 68. Great job! You've just completed 10 questions on adding two-digit numbers. Keep practicing, and you'll become a math pro in no time. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Digit Math for more fun math lessons. See you in the next video.